What's up guys and welcome to another video and let's get ready to wake up and react to another episode of Death Note Season 1 Episode 4. Something new today, I'm going to try this in the dub, so I let people on Patreon know ahead of time. Um, I probably already made a post about this on YouTube, I'll probably make a post before I post it, but I'm going to say it here just in case you know you didn't go to the community tab because not everyone does. Um, I am going to try the dub out for this episode because... I feel like, I, so I was looking around on YouTube because I'm like, why are my videos getting taken down when I see other people having the whole image up, no editing done, I'm like, unless they're just picking on me, there's something I'm not doing. So it, it seems like most of the videos that I find online are dubs of death, like, of death Note reactions. So I'm like, okay, now either most people watch dubs and that's just why there's more dubs on YouTube or it's the fact that they people did put sub reactions up it's just that they're being taken down more um often so i guess i'm guessing that like the japanese version uh you know whoever like i don't know whoever copyrights it they're more strict than the people are for the english dub so I'm gonna try this out. I'm gonna try the dub out. Uh, also, what I'm trying out for the first time is headphones. So I'm hoping the audio is okay. I hope it's not like quiet and I hope you guys can hear me okay. Um, I'm a little nervous about that. I'm like scared that, you know, that I messed it up or something. Or I, I did a few like little test clips. I did like a few where I'm like recording and I'm letting a video play and I feel like you can hear me pretty well, but I'm still kind of nervous about it, so I hope, I don't know, hopefully this is okay. Hopefully this is okay for you guys, but, um, yeah. <laughs> uh, what happened last time on Death Note? Um, so, okay. Last time we were, uh, Light is going to try to get L and the police to uh, focus on each other versus him and by the police focusing and being suspicious of L they're going to try to figure out who he is because it's hard to trust someone when you don't know their true face their true identity or whatever so I guess that I don't know I don't know if that's going to work out for him or not but it might um and then like I said because they know or because L knows he is related somehow has a cop's mentality of like whatever he's done whatever l or light has done to have this cop's mentality whether he is a cop himself or he knows a cop related to a cop whatever and he was on his list of like people like of, of the kin of the policeman on the on this on this um force or whatever on this job assigned to this uh whatever you want to call it this this case there we go i couldn't think of the word so he's aware of him and someone was following him at the end of last episode so i don't know if that was someone from the fbi because they were calling fbi in but anyways what i'm trying to say is because they know he has a cop's mentality he has access to the cop's information on this case or on any case probably they're gonna know oh he's gonna think l's gonna think light or well this criminal is gonna think like a cop so he'll probably do this and because light knows this he's gonna do the opposite of what they think he'll do that's what i think and then l might be like oh well since he knows that i know he's got a cop's mentality he's gonna think to do the opposite because that's what i would do in his situation so what would the opposite do and then it's just gonna be, i don't know some back and forth crazy bullshit like that i don't know um and then him killing people at different times to try to throw them off and blah 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 right like writing down they're gonna die on this day uh at this time and then they're ha they're fucking dying when he's at school playing soccer. Oh, I have an alibi. I was at school. All my friends saw me. Woo. Whatever. Ugh, it's perfect. But not really because Elle's a genius. And, uh, well, so is Light. But it's genius against genius. So, um, anything else? I don't know. Hmm. I think that's it. So, uh, yeah, remember, oh my god, my hair is stuck behind my shoulder, okay. Let's try that again, that was really awkward. 
Remember to like, share, and subscribe, and hit that notification bell to be notified every time I upload a video. And if you guys want full reactions, you can catch that on my Patreon. Other than that, let's jump into the reaction, guys. Oh my god, what do I even say? Shit. Oh my god, that's... Oh my god. How smart are you? To, like, plan that whole deliberate, just, just that whole fucking intricate scheme just to oh my god just to make yourself like seem innocent but it was so detailed it was so detailed guys like oh man <sighs> wow 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 i can't even what the fuck wow that's insane. I can't believe he did all that shit. Alright, guys. It was a great video. Oh, weird. Doing the dub with also earphones and also having really bad OCD today. I don't know if it's this shirt that feels so constricting or if it's... I just feel so... It's, like, hard to breathe. Like, I feel claustrophobic. I feel like... This is definitely leaning too much one way. Um, and it's like, if I feel like it looks good this way, I feel like it doesn't look good once I, like, turn the camera. It's so hard. It's so hard to just get it where I want it, you know what I mean? So it's... Ooh. It's a struggle. Um, I cannot wear this shirt. Hang on. Anyways, holy shit. That shirt fucking sucked. That whole time. That sucked. That shirt is so freaking like... Oh my god. It's, this is just so much better. This is better. Um, Okay. So I did not understand what he was trying to do at first, right? Because he's like... Oh yeah, I've got a plan. And he starts killing these people in jail. And they're like really oh random... God. So anyways, um, so like, he's like, killing, like, what is he, five people, he said, and they're all killed in like, really, like, they have heart attacks, all of them, but like, the things leading up to their deaths are odd, right? One of them drawing a freaking, like, um, I don't even call that, like a, is it like a pentagon, or a, fuck, it's like a star where, like, like, when I've seen it used in movies, it's kind of like when they're, like, summoning, like, a demon or something like that. I forgot what that's called, but... Anyways, so that symbol, um, in their own blood, gross. Mm. Oh, I don't even want to know how that happened. Um, and then the other one, like, wrote a weird letter saying, yeah, light, or, not light, Kira's out to get me, Kira's out to get me, he's gonna kill me. Um, and then, what was the other shit? Uh... don't remember well anyways the other shit so it was just like i didn't understand i'm like what is he doing what is the point of all this and then it's like okay he's trying to see the limits of the death note really smart actually on his part i was very impressed by that because like i didn't think like why would you need to know like i just never would have thought of that like at least maybe eventually i would have because like i would have i don't know i would have wanted to do something crazy but I mean, he just does things, like, at such a faster pace than you would expect a normal animal, animal, anime character to do them at, and it's just, that's why it takes me by surprise so much, because I'm like, he's doing it so quickly, all of this shit, he just, like, it escalates so fast, so already he wants to know what the limits are, right? Maybe to some of you, he should have done that in the first episode, I don't know, but to me, I'm just like, I wasn't even thinking of that, but yeah, okay, so he knows he can't, like, make the impossible happen. If someone's in jail in Japan, they can't die in front of the Eiffel Tower in France the next day. Like, that's just not gonna happen. First of all, they're in jail. How the fuck are they gonna get out of jail? So there's that. But, I mean, the other shit, like, I, I, it's true, like, you can't, oh, and the other thing he figured out is, like, you can't, what is it, like, I don't know how I would even phrase my sentence. Like, you can't make someone know something they don't already know. Or you can't ask them to tell you something if they don't know it. If they genuinely don't know it. Like that one guy, like, draw L's face before you die or something like that. And 
he couldn't because he'd never seen Elle's face, and it's okay. Now we know the limits. So you can't just go write down any old cop's name to tell you, like, hey, tell me Elle's name before you die. Because they're not going to be able to do it, and then you just killed someone unnecessarily, right? I don't know if he would kill a cop just for nothing. I mean, if they were on to him, yes. Like that guy on the bus, that detective or that FBI agent, I mean. I was surprised he didn't kill him. But if that, if he figured him out, he would have. Because he already said he's going to kill his family if they figure it out. If they become a problem, I'm going to have to take him out. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> so, there's that. Um, I was kind of worried there. I really thought he was going to kill that FBI agent. But then the whole thing on the bus, I'm like, what is this? Oh, he's going to play hero. He's going to save the day. Like, oh, there's no way he's Kira. No, no, no. That's not it at all. No. This whole freaking ploy just to get the detective's name. Now I've got your name, bitch. Now I can kill you if I need to. But he already said that, well, I mean, Light doesn't know this, but he already said after today he's not going to be investigating him anymore. <sighs> Sorry. So I guess he's, like, in the clear for now. Um, but I don't know if he knows that. Maybe he'll, like, check their, um, the police database and see, like, check it. Oh, Light isn't innocent. Yeah, Light is innocent. Uh, and if he sees that, he'll be like, all right, cool, I don't have to kill you. But I will if you start digging again. Dude, you're, I already know his dad's gonna start digging. He's gonna start getting, like, suspicious at some point. And he's gonna, like, it's fuzzy. He's, or hair, not fuzzy, whatever. Uh, he's gonna end up having to kill his dad. And I don't know how that's going to affect him. Like, is that mentally going to fuck him up? Or is he gonna be just, like, pretty much unaffected? Like, oh, well, you got my way. Sorry, Dad. Whew. I don't know. Um, and then that whole thing with Ryukyu. So, like, yeah, he said if they touch the Death Note, they can see me. But that doesn't mean he can't kill them, right? I mean, they don't own the Death Note. So... He could have killed him if he wanted to, but if he did that, it would have fucked up Light's whole plan, so I get why he didn't do it. It would have, like, really made Light seem suspicious because, oh, some weird thing, some, they can't see Ryuki, so they can't blame it on him, so it's gonna be like, hmm, some guy just all of a sudden died. Oddly, hmm, yeah, no, 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 like, Getting hit by a car, that, and you see Light's not writing anything. So, I mean, I guess that's like, that's why they don't think it's him, but. If Ryukyu did kill that guy, he just like started having a heart attack, but I don't think Ryukyu would do that though, because that would really fuck up Light's whole thing, and he's not trying to fuck it up, right? He's trying to be objective, so I guess that's why he didn't do anything, and he just let it play out how it did. Um, but... I mean, because I guess someone's seeing him... I'm just wondering why he didn't do anything. Did he not do it because he didn't want to fuck up Light's plans? And because, I mean... Depending on how the guy died, like, if Ryuk did... Ryukyu, Ryuk... I don't know how to say it, but... If Ryukyu did end up killing him... I think it would depend on how he killed him. Um, like... On whether that would make Light seem suspicious or not, like... If he just wrote, oh, he gets hit by a car, then, yeah, that wouldn't make Light seem suspicious, but then again, Light already had his death in place, so, like, what, could Ryukyu, like, write in his own death note and, like, cancel out Light's death sentence thing? I don't know, I don't know what you would call it, but seriously, oh, I wonder, that's interesting, like, not that he would, but, um, and, like, Light can't write down Ryukyu's name in his death note, right? Like, he can't kill him, right? Um, I don't know if they ever... I mean, they said the only way they die is if they run out of life, right? So they didn't... But they never said... Did he say... Did he ever, like, address that? Like, oh, you don't even think about writing my name in there because you can't kill me. But I'm assuming since he didn't say... Like, he said the only way he can die is if he runs out of his lifespan... I'm assuming that writing his name in the death note wouldn't kill him. Um, I'm all over the place. But yeah, so like, could, but could Ryukyu like cancel out a Light's death note? Or whatever he wrote in his death note, if he wanted to? Not that he would, I know he wouldn't because he doesn't want to interfere, but I'm saying could he if he wanted to? Um, don't answer that if that's a spoiler, but if it's just something that I, I just missed, then let me know. 
Um, what else? Um, freaking, um, what was I saying about this whole bus thing? Let me remember. I don't want to forget anything. Uh, um, Ryukyu. So, if he... So that's why he didn't do anything, right? He didn't want to interfere. Okay, I get that. Um, and like I said, even if he, if he did kill him and, he, and the guy had a heart attack, that makes life look suspicious. Um, but if he did it in, like, a different way, then it probably wouldn't look like light did it. Because, I mean, his hands are, like, it's not that. But they know he can control the time at which someone dies. So they might just, like, think it's that. You know what I mean? But... Again, I know Light already had his death in place, so even if Ryukyu did write something, there's no guarantee it would happen, because they didn't say anything about that yet. Um, like, what would happen if they both wrote down someone's name in, like, different ways of them dying, or whatever. Um, but I'm assuming, I'm assuming since he's a Shinigami, his would win, right? Like, by default, it would be Ryukyu's death, death note thing that would win. Um, what else happened this episode? Kind of feel bad that girl got used. He probably doesn't even like her for real, so she's getting all her hopes up. Yeah, we're going on. A that was a shitty date, though. I mean, you were like held at gunpoint pretty much. Uh, poor thing. Don't drag her out on any more dates, dude. Just leave her alone. <sighs> what else happened, though? I don't know if L even put together what he was doing. He didn't figure out what his whole plan was, so. He's good there. Light's good on that front. Um, I'm surprised he denied the eyes. I really didn't think he would do that because he's so power hungry, but he did. And he it actually pleasantly surprised me because I think that's smarter because he said, I plan, <laughs> well, it's kind of like God complex, yeah. I plan to be a God and rule over the world for a, a really long time. Like, okay. Okay. That doesn't sound very godly to me. Like, I don't feel like that's something... Well, there are shitty gods. So he could be a god, just not a really good one. I'm not... When I say good, I mean as in, like... Not good as in, oh, he's great, like, at his job. No. I mean, like, he's probably not gonna be, like, a very compassionate, empathetic god. Uh, merciful. No, none of that. I don't believe so at all, no. So... Yeah, maybe you'll be a god, but you're gonna be a really mean one. <laughs> be afraid of you, dude. Fuck that. I'll... Yes, sir. Anything you say, light, sir. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no. I would not cross him. Um, anything else? I don't want to forget anything. Yeah, he called that girl. I mean, the dub was decent. I didn't have any problems with it. I think Ryukyu's voice was funny. Or not funny, um, he said something funny, I just was thinking of two, of two things at once. His voice was cool. He said something funny, like, oh, he's like, you know, you could have told me this earlier. Yeah. Uh, because he said, like, oh, I don't want you complaining that I didn't tell you this earlier. He's like, well, you didn't tell me this earlier, and you could have. And he's like, are you sure there's nothing else you should have told me earlier? Nah. Or... Probably not. Or something like that. I don't know. It was funny. Oh, fuck. <sighs> okay. But anyways. Uh, did I talk about everything now? I feel like I did. It was a pretty good episode, though. Um. Anyways. So. Yeah. Calm down. Calm down. I know your OCD's a bitch. But calm down. Alright, guys. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. And hit that notification bell to be notified every time I upload a video. And if you guys want full reactions, you can catch that on my Patreon. Other than that, I'm going to get out of here, guys, and I will catch you in the next reaction.